Hello, welcome back to the channel. Right before I start, I would just like to say that the following story was written by one of my subscribers, Wolfpack. Thank you Wolfpack for allowing me to read your story, I appreciate it greatly. If you would like to check out the story for yourself, you can find it in the channel's discord. The link to the discord is in the channel's description. There you not only can you find this story, but you can also find other stories written by Wolfpack which are only available on the discord. So again, thank you Wolfpack for allowing me to read your story, I appreciate it greatly. I have heard of many legends of supernatural beings that have always fascinated me. From the forgotten creatures of myth, like the Werehiena, to ones more well known, such as Grendel from the Beowulf stories. It's interesting to learn about these creatures. I also like the monsters that come from the internet, ranging from teen emo joker boys, like Jeff the Killer. To the actual monsters, my personal favorite being Eyeless Jack and the Bridge Worms. I always like these ones better than most, as everyone seems to pay attention to other creatures like Slenderman and whatever the cartoon cat is. One story that I heard about is the Zimmerman experiment, which is honestly a really good one. The ending of the Zimmerman experiment brings me to what I'm going to talk about soon. At the end of the story, a demonic creature tied to an eerie old song from the singer Tiny Tim was starting to hunt down the narrator. This brings me to a monster I've been looking into for a while now and I seem to be the only one. I have heard of the being I called the singing man. The singing man has been hinted at in many reports from over the years. Here are some examples. In the mid-1950s, Jeremy Ernst was going on a hunting trip. When he was gathering his gear, he told his hunting partner that he had heard a strange singing outside his window. Oddly enough, he remembered what was in the lyrics down to the last detail. The lyrics were in Latin, but I have managed to translate them. I'm going on a hunting trip. I think I hear a deer nearby. Is anyone else there? Stop. Don't shoot. After this, police found the bodies of both Jeremy and his hunting partner. Both of their bodies were riddled with bullet holes. The killer was never found. The police interviewed Jeremy's wife Isabel, who told him of the strange song she heard when she was with her husband. Another example is 40 years later. Henry 8, pronounced like the number 8 apparently, was coming home late one night. Before he went to bed, he heard someone sing. I translated these lyrics as well. I'm going to get a drink. Man, it's dark out. I'm getting tired. I think I'll take a... Henry was found dead after he crashed his car into a big tree. When a blood test was done by the police after they found him, Henry was discovered to have been drinking while driving. According to the bartender, Henry ironically had 8 glasses in total. 2 cocktails, 4 shots, and 2 glasses of whiskey. I am unsure as to why the singing man does this. I first seem to think that he acted as an angel of death, with its lyrics describing how its targeted recipient will die, but I was wrong. Another victim from the 70s, Samantha Richards, woke up to someone singing from inside her house. Here are the translated lyrics. Is someone in my house? Who's there? Please stop. No. She was found a week later when her co-workers reported that she didn't show up for work. Samantha was found in her living room with a look of absolute terror. Her mouth was wide open as if screaming. Her skin was extremely pale for somebody who liked to exercise each weekend. 
and she overall looked like a ghost. What scares me the most about this is that she heard the singing from inside her house. She kept a journal she liked to write in and wrote down the lyrics she heard. I believe the singing man is either some sort of supernatural killer or something trying to predict how people will die with his lyrics. To make things worse, this isn't the last sighting. With the singing man being heard and reported throughout the years, the last two being half a year ago, until now. I'm next. I know I am. I woke up this morning just before sunrise to hear a man singing from somewhere nearby. This is the end. He is coming for me. If I don't make it, oh god, he's here. These are the transcribed lyrics and I wanted to address this so people become aware. To my family, I am so sorry, but this is the end. It's not my fault, at least I don't think so. He's coming for me. If I don't make it, share this with as many people as you can. Please, get the word out. As I finish writing this, I hear footsteps coming to me. Oh God, he's here. <laughs>